Okay, this is a quick video on how to repair your steering uh, on your lawnmower. Uh, we were mowing along and the steering would not steer. And what I did was I took my covers off my motor and looked down in here. And what happened was, <coughs> with the steering column goes through the mower deck down at the bottom here there is a see this hole right in the center of your screen uh, shaped like a hex there is a bushing that goes there and those bushings will go out um, this is what the bushing looks like this is a brand new bushing um, so when these bushings wear out on the inside that allows more free play down at the at the bottom of your drive of your steering shaft and then your mower will not steer they're a simple fix this one little parts like three dollars also while you're re repairing the, your part you might as well go ahead and buy this uh, new cog or gear that goes on the end of your steering shaft so that you'll have good tight steering total cost of these two parts is about fourteen dollars and you can get these from your local uh, store and here is the part number it's called a MTD or Murray Tractor Division hex bushing and it's a 9410656 and they're apparently made by Oregon Um, so the part number of the uh, steering gear uh, this was 542097 let's see if there's any other part numbers on there you may need Yeah, five four two zero nine seven. Uh or there's a number here, I don't know if this is it. Seven one seven dash uh one five five four. Anyway, that ought to get you your part. Once you get these two two parts, you just simply uh take your deck off of the mower so you can get down there. <coughs> and then there's a a bolt that holds all this on undo that bolt replace your bushing and your gear and you're back in business uh, now to replace the part all you do is lift the steering shaft up as you see here I have it lifted up out from the bottom and then I'm just going to slide the bushing in there uh, into this this little hex slot okay have the little bushing in there and now you just simply lower your steering shaft down in there nice and nice and smooth okay and then put your new gear and your bolt on and I'll show you what it looks like under the mower here's the gear and the bolt that's it now then as you turn the steering wheel you can turn your wheels just like it shows here
Okay. Fairly simple fix. Back in business. Thanks for watching. Hope this helps.